beautiful Capricorns, welcome back. This is your bonus reading. Capricorn, please and thank you. Capricorn's messages, please and thanks. We're talking about Capricorn blaming you. Someone's feeling foolish. <laughs> they could have been manipulating you, rejected you, ghosted you. <laughs> Some kind of karma here. For them, I don't know. They could have hurt you. I'm just saying. They were insecure. So somebody could have hurt you based upon their own insecurities, based upon their own fears, based upon their own hurts. It's like they could have judged you, they could have blamed you, they could have... You're over here very loving. I mean, this is someone very loving. So... What did this person do? It's almost like I'm going to cheat on you before you cheat on me. That's what I'm picking up here. I'm going to do you nasty. I'm going to do you dirty before you get the chance to do me dirty. This is crazy. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Why is somebody so angry that... You're getting some kind of karmic justice. Somebody is like angry. Oh, because they're in regret. They're sorry. Somebody's sorry for juggling you or somebody is regretful and sorry wants to apologize. So maybe somebody took something out on you, blamed you for something, got mad at you for something, and you was telling the truth. <laughs> you were telling the truth. You were being honest. I want to see what this person has to say. They're saying they're sorry. They don't want you to judge them. I've been praying to God for you to forgive me. You're still with someone. They believe their own lies that they told themselves about you. This person might have just been buying you things here or there. Uh-oh, so it's almost like they cursed themselves by doing this. And the only way they can break this curse is true love. You did nothing wrong. It was me. I believed my own lies about you. That's what I said. It's like, it's almost like they were punishing you, blaming you for something, but you were innocent of it. You were telling the truth about something. They were lying to others about you to make themselves look good.
they'd feel empty. Somebody wants the chance to heal what they wounded and what they hurt. The sun. Someone's been praying to God. I'm telling you. Told ya. Someone's been praying here. Someone's harnessing their power through prayer and the universe. It's pent up energy. They want to fix what they wounded. They want to heal and fix what they wounded. This is their actions. Please don't judge me for who I was. Judge me for now. This is... This person is trying to harness their power through prayer and through um, this person's had a lot of tough times here. They're trying to heal. They got stuck. They could have blamed you. They could have accused you. They could have, like, pushed you away. I don't know. They said, please don't judge me for my past. I This person's admitting they made mistakes, which I will give them credit for. They are admitting that they made mistakes. It's like this person wants to give you something. They want to make things fair or right with you. It's taken this person a long time. I think that They were believing their own lies to make themselves look good. This person lied on you and they started believing those lies. They believe their own lies that they told themselves. It's 
it's almost like this person was in the energy, like I said, of I'm going to get you before you get me. I'm going to get one up on you. I'm going to get to you. I'm going to I'm going to hurt you. I'm going to do this because I know you're going to do that to me. That's what they're saying. And they regret it. They feel foolish. And they're angry. This person has learned to control their anger, learned to control their emotions, their feelings. This person is doing a lot of soul searching. This person truly has. I'm going to give them credit on this one for admitting that they made mistakes, for owning up to it, and for trying to change. doesn't mean you got to take them back it just means that someone is owning up to what they did take care now